G'day humans, Chris Stead here. Hold on to your goggles, because this right here is the Andamanda Water Park in Phuket, Thailand's famous wave pool. Eww. In this video, you're gonna learn exactly what it's like. Are we there yet? No! Are we there yet? No! Are we there yet? No! Are we there yet? Yes! Now this is the view that greets you as you get to the giant 10,000 square meter wave pool, which has got 300 meters of sandy beach around the outside of it and generates waves up to three meters tall. Now the waves that were here when I was visiting were definitely not three meters tall, but they were still pretty sizey as you'll see. And uh, I've done a bigger review of the entire park, which you can check out on the channel, but such as the popularity or at least renown of this pool that I thought a little video focusing just on it was worth it. Uh, so if you're considering, if you're in Phuket, Thailand, and you're considering going to the Andamanda Wave Pool or Andamanda Water Park, I recommend seeing the full review video. Uh, but this is the Wave Pool. And as you can see, they're pretty popular destination. In fact, it's very much a ride itself. We actually end up spending a lot of time in here. Because as you can see, it's a lot bigger than most of the wave pools that you get at water parks. Boom. Now you can see it from up here, which is on the, uh, these are the water villas. So if you've got a water villa, you look down on the wave and you can see that's my son there having a go. And you can see the waves crashing in. It's actually a really cool view from there. And you can see, you know, keep a good watchful eye over your kids. The kids probably spent a good couple of hours over the course of the day in there just jumping over the waves. And my kids live at a beach, so they're used to it. Now on the other side, you've got this swim up bar experience as well. So here you can guys sit there and have a drink or play in the pool and then just look out over the waves as well. So that's kind of got what border on either side, as long as it's some kind of like fake limestone, or shim it's fake limestone rock looks, just to kind of give it that, uh, you know, really fun and cool aesthetic. Cocktails weren't too badly priced either. So this is what it's like if you, when you, as you walk into the wave pool. Now, about, they run about every 15 minutes through most of the day. And so you'll kind of hear a sound and you'll, you'll, you'll see all the excitement as people race for the pool. And then it calms down, it gives you just a very still lake for a while. Now, you're not allowed to jump off those rocks, sadly. And uh, you're not actually allowed to swim out that far either. I tried swimming out towards those rocks you can see at the back and very promptly got into trouble. So you know, I'm not sure what I did wrong there, but anyway, they don't like you going up there. Uh, they all like you just kind of hanging around where it breaks, which is just kind of in here. And you see, once it goes, it goes. Now you can see they're probably going about halfway out the walls there. Then kind of barrels a little bit, not too much, and there's usually some like side waves and wobble afterwards. You can see those little waves that kind of come through between the waves. Um, but they're definitely big enough to kind of catch. And you can just do some body surfing. I have seen photos of people actually surfing it, uh, but I, that was, I, there was no indication that you could actually do that uh, while you're there. So I don't know, maybe they have very special days there where you can actually surf it, um, but they'd have to change the shape somehow because it just closes out basically. Uh, and the water, yeah, so they can get up to three meters, which it, that wall to me is three meters. So I don't know how a three meter wave would actually go, uh, in this confined space, whether they actually ever do it. Um, but this wave is big enough for sure, and the kids love it. So there you go, there's a look at the wave pool at the Andamanda Water Park in Phuket, Thailand. Make sure you check out the full review so you can see what all the rides are like and, and learn a lot more about the experience. And otherwise I'm just gonna leave you with the, the closing parade. 